So my name is Stacy Borden. I'm the executive director, founder of New Beginners Ranchy Services. We're located in Dorchester, Massachusetts. Okay, the mission of New Beginners Reentry Services is to provide services for women coming out of prison, reintegrating back into community and family. I'm formerly incarcerated, and I know what it's like to try to reintegrate back into community with no resources. For decades, we've had a lack of resources in our black and brown communities, and the women in prison raised me, and I just felt like I made a promise to them that I was going to get out and do something different so we never have to go to prison again. So I'm so proud that it was a fight to come back to our community. We know that the resources are outside of our community and the more that we come out of prison and go to the other communities, the funding and the resources are all in those communities, but we don't often feel accepted in those communities and we needed to be back in our own community where harm was caused, where harm was caused to us, where we've caused harm and we needed to learn to sit still and be home. And so it was a fight to get back into our community. Nobody wanted us in that backyard. And so proud to say that we knocked on 500 doors, we went through the whole zoning board process, and we got approved to be right in our own community, which we can build back into our own community. Well, I think that I need to say I'm proud that Frontline Solutions really supported us and heard our mission. And then the state of Massachusetts gave us a really good grant so we can reach not only the women that we serve in the residential home, but 60 women formerly incarcerated in the community. And so we started a series of workshops from February to June, and we've been able to reach 49 out of the 60 we were trying to reach, and the women love the workshops. They really love the resources that we've been able to provide as well as educational services that we've been really targeting universities and really giving them some educational support all the way to free uh, bachelor's degrees with Clark University, with Tufts University. And we're really breaking barriers of people coming out of prison and really achieving some goals. Really excited that we have the attention of our Congresswoman Ayanna Presley. We have the attention of our senators, Senator Eldridge, Senator Diaz, our state representatives, Rep. Tyler, Rep. Miranda has really been supportive and really can see the significance, the need of really giving these type of support services and resources to people coming out of prison something that hasn't been done in our community before. And so I'm really excited about the future and the support from the state, from the representatives, and from now the community. We're there, we're open, we're thriving, and the future looks really bright and we're happy.